Hello everybody and welcome to the Marin Music YouTube channel. Well, it's almost July here in Chicago, which means the weather is finally starting to be nice. And that means my family and I have been spending a lot of time outside here in the sunroom. And when we're out here hanging out, we like to listen to music. And so far we've been doing that with an old home theater speaker plugged into this old Radio Shack mono amplifier. And then I have here an RCA to headphone jack adapter and we plug our phones into that because we're still rocking phones that have headphone jacks. And while this works, it's not a perfect solution, but I do have something that's gonna be great to replace it with. And that's this old stereo end table cabinet. Now this has a speaker in the bottom and a quarter inch jack in the back. And generally these were used to plug into either old radios or old hi-fi units and either throw more sound across the room or give you a stereo image. And I think it's time that we repurpose this and put it back to work and make it a part of the 21st century. Okay, so I didn't do a ton of research. I just hopped on Amazon and found this cheap board for $10 and ordered it. Now it has Bluetooth and an aux in, which I won't need. And you just have to power it up with, I think anywhere from five to 24 volts, plug in your speakers and you're up and running. Now my only real criterion that I wanted was to not have one that had any buttons on it because I'm gonna seal this up inside the cabinet and I don't wanna have to figure out any way to get to the buttons or need to get to them at all. So I should be able to just seal this up inside and not have to worry about it. So I think the first thing we need to do is track down a power supply. Now I think if I dig around in this drawer, full of old power supplies should have something that should work. Let's see. And we got this one, which is reading DC 12 volt output. Yep. That should do us nicely. Okay, so even though the speaker on this cabinet works fine, once I opened it up, I saw that this cabling in here is just super crusty and bad, and you can just pull all the insulation off. So I'm gonna go ahead and snip it back here and replace all of this as well. Now to run the power cable into the cabinet, I'm just going to drill a hole in the bottom so I can feed the cable through and plug it into the board. Now since the board I have is a stereo board, so it has a left and right output, but I'm only using one speaker, I could either plug in that one speaker to either the left and right channel, and it would work, but anything that is coming out of the separate channel I would not hear. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna plug the negative into my right negative and the positive into my left positive, and that will give me both left and right channels out of this one speaker. And I couldn't find any screws small enough to fit through the mounting holes of this board. So I'm just going to use a piece of double-sided tape in order to stick it down. And that's really all there is to it. We can power it up now and make sure it works. Okay. 
Seems to be working fine. Let's put the back panel back on and move it back out to the sunroom. Okay, so I've gone ahead and moved it outside, plugged it back in, and now I can go ahead and connect. And play some music. Well, there you go, that wraps up this project and this video. Now, I didn't want to spend a ton of time and effort and money kind of building something like this. I just wanted to get it done so we could start enjoying it. And I'm happy with the results we got from that and the effort that I put into it. Now, obviously, you might not be able to find or might not have a kind of stereo extension end table speaker cabinet thing. But if you wanted to do something similar to this, I would recommend trying to find old home theater speakers from either resale shops, estate sales, garage sales, anything like that. You can pick them up pretty much anywhere pretty cheap, and then you could just add a Bluetooth board to it and have pretty much the same outcome for about the same amount of effort. Anyways, that's enough talk from me. I'm gonna go outside, listen to some music, and enjoy this beautiful day, but I will see you next time.